What does Burger King have that McDonald's don't? Onion rings. What do you wish you had but you don't? Onion rings. Why? Because the typical onion rings at Burger King can cost you between 320 calories to 500 calories and that's not good for your diet. But don't fret because I'm going to show you guys a healthier version that is only 108 calories per serving. Less than one gram of fat. Shall we begin? Yes! Okay, so you're going to need onions, Fiber One brand cereal, egg substitutes, some seasoning, and a food processor. Let's start by preparing our onions. You want to cut the onions into one inch in width, and we're going to separate them into onion rings. Let's season our onion rings with your season of choice. I'm just using salt, pepper, garlic powder, and Kanye pepper. Now let's create our coating. We're gonna add that Fiber One brand cereal into our food processor. And this is a great food processor to really grate up that cereal. It definitely grinds up the cereal to make it into this flour consistency. You're gonna prepare the pan with parchment paper and add a little bit of butter spray. Preheat the oven to 400 degrees and let's better it up. We're gonna just add some egg substitutes to our onion rings, one serving. And we're gonna place those onion rings into that batter. This is really easy and simple. As long as you're using that food processor, this will be a breeze. And one by one, it should start to look like this. Now I'm just adding a little bit of the excess batter left on top of the onion rings. I just add additional salt and pepper for extra flavor, which is optional. Now it is ready to bake. We're gonna put it in the oven for about 15 minutes. 15 minutes later, we're going to take it out the oven and flip them over. Flip over the onion rings so it does not burn. This is an important step, don't forget to do that. Now we're gonna put it back in the oven, cook for 10 to 15 additional minutes. And when they're done, they should look something like this. Yummy. Mm -hmm. Now I'm just setting it in the plate. It's really crispy and healthy. Add a little bit of ketchup, which is the perfect dip for these onion rings. Okay, so that's it for this onion ring recipe. I'll have the ingredients in the video description, so make sure you check that out. Definitely make sure you guys like this video and subscribe for weekly videos. And also check out this do-it-yourself popcorn video. New videos every week. I'll see you soon. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.